So this video is on connecting your InConnect, mapping your rooms to the booking channels. Um, so let's go into channels and we're going to go into booking.com. There's a little gray settings button right here. Uh, it's, it's hard to see, most people miss it, but go ahead and click on that. Now this is a general rate adjustment. So if you want to just adjust the rate to just booking.com you can say like 10% more or you can say like you want to give a discount you can put minus 10% going towards booking.com or you can increase the rate, rate by just putting 10 but if you don't put a minus it's going to send more so just remember that so right here it'll be sending the increasing the rate by 10% if you if you want to decrease it you'll have to put a minus there if you see this then you can already start mapping your rooms but if you don't see anything hit fetch rates sometimes the customer will make a room in the channel and a room in the in connect however they'll have different names so it is these times that we may need your help with mapping your rooms because uh, this customer here, he wrote the same name for both the channel room and InConnect, so that's good. But sometimes they may say like deluxe double pool view and over here they'll say two beds with the kitchen and we have no idea that it goes to this room, but you do. So when that happens, we may ask for your help. And through this video, you can learn how to map your rooms. Now here, when you just click on this, it's going to show you all the room types that you listed on InConnect. And you're going to choose which one goes to which. Now after that, you, most hotels will just, uh, they'll just select standard rate. Now as you can see, there is a couple of different deals here listed that is available on um, to the customer. Now we can go ahead and send these rates but how we how we would do that is we would click on active and then we would click on adjustments. Now you see how it says minus 75 last minute deal I would have to put minus 75 right here. If there was a USD discount I would put the USD discount and then hit the green OK button to save. After doing that, which I'm go not going to do, but after doing that, I would hit Save Settings down here. If you close this InConnect out without saving the settings by clicking this button right here, nothing will be saved. So you always want to make sure that you save your settings. The same is pretty much the same for Expedia. So uh, just couple of things to remember gray settings up here is a little tricky you gotta remember that you click on this one and most hotels pick the standard rate uh, even if there's several rates listed and don't forget to make your adjustments to match with your deal on the channel and that is it